All right, a nice sunny day out here. And today I'm gonna to do some flying. I'm gonna test out a feature of that DJI will uh, promote as being an awesome feature that uh, maybe they only have. So when DJI comes out with a new product, such as I have over there, the Phantom 4 Pro, the Mavic Pro and the Spark, they list a bunch of features it has and they always add something new to each each product. So one thing they've brought out late last year was the precision landing. That means when you take off from a location, such as a landing pad that I have out here, uh, it should be able to fly out and if you hit return to home, it should be able to come back and land exactly where it took off. So I've got three DJI products. There's no wind and I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna fly them out to about, uh, let's say 50 meters away. I'll fly them to a height of uh, 20 meters and I'm gonna set the return to home to 45 meters for all three. Hit the return to home button, let them come back and let's see if they land on the landing pad. If they don't, they're gonna land on the grass and the grass is kind of wet and nobody wants that. So let's hope, DJI, let's hope it works. Stay tuned. Now when the drone takes off, I'm gonna fly it straight up to about 20 meters and I'm just gonna let it sit there so it has a good look at the landing pad and then I will take it out 50 meters and then I'll hit the return to home. So here we go, power up. So the sensors are obviously picking up some grass in front. I will just lift up straight. There we are, I'm at 20, 20 meters height. Then I'm gonna fly it forward 50 meters. Actually, I'm gonna change that to all the drones. I'll fly them forward 100 meters so we have a bit more distance. Here we go. Flying forward. 30 meters, 40 meters, 50 meters, 60, 70, 80, 90, slowing down. There we are. We're at, uh, well, actually we're at 113 meters now because this thing doesn't slow down too fast. So now I'm gonna hit the return to home. All right, hitting the return to home now. Go home. Okay, it's spinning around. Let's see if it finds the landing pad. It's up, up above. I'm gonna hand hold this camera so I can follow it. There it is, it's looking for something. It's spinning around. It's facing away. I can't tell which way it's facing, but it's coming down. Let's see, where is it gonna land? Is it gonna land on my bag? So is it gonna land in the right spot? It's looking good so far. Let's move these bags out of the way. Let's see what's going. It stopped, it's thinking. I think it wants me to take control, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to let it sit there. But I have to admit, that's what it does. Look at the landing pad. Let's go see what the controller says here. What's my controller say? Not suitable for landing. Oh, that's why it wouldn't go down. Landing area not suitable. So I obviously have the, uh, make sure you check the landing area before landing. So I'm gonna hit okay. And I'm just gonna pull down the left button here. There she is over there. So let's go see how perfect that was. Well, I would say that's pretty damn amazing. 
Okay, Phantom 4 Pro. You are awesome for pretty much landing back where you took off. All right, let's try the Mavic. All right, got the Mavic. Let's get it ready. Give him a protector, give him a lock. This thing used to be the smallest DJI drone at one time, but now it just looks massive compared to the Spark. But it is still an amazing drone. This thing is freaking amazing, actually. All right, got the controller, got a battery. Let's see how much battery power I got. All right, Mavic Pro is powered on. Okay, just like I did for the Phantom 4 Pro, I'm going to I'm going to turn on the camera, it says I got GPS, everything's at the home point, it's been recorded. Uh, all that good stuff, powered on. I hear the word takeoff, so I'm going to lift it straight up to 20 meters. Here we go. Watch my screen. There we are, 20 meters. That is much more quiet than the Phantom 4 Pro. That is a very quiet drone. All right, so on my screen, can't see it as well as the Phantom 4 Pro. So I'm gonna fly this baby out uh, 100 meters. Fifty meters, sixty meters, seventy meters, eighty meters, ninety. Let go of the throttle. There we are. We're, gonna, we're at one hundred and nine meters. All right. So I'm going to hit the return to home button. Let's see what it does. There we go. It's coming around, and it's going to fly back to me. on the controller, it's beeping away. Oh, it's gone into landing mode, it's spinning around, and it should be coming down to me now. Okay, so this is where I had some technical problems with my camera. For some reason, it stopped recording. So we have to rely on the video from the Mavic Pro as it's landing. As you can see here, it's doing a great job. It's coming down and I was really surprised. The Mavic Pro stays massively stable and wait until you see this. It lands in the most amazing position, just like when it took off. I had to grab my cell phone camera to, to capture this, but uh, check it out. You can see it right here, taken with the cell phone camera from a distance. Watch it land. Bang, right where it took off. That's awesome. All right, put the Mavic back. It's all done. And now take out our tiny little Spark. All right, here we have the DJI Spark on the landing pad. Not only does DJI have a great aim, but check this out. Some bird just pooped on my landing pad. Right there, right between the freaking Spark and the controller. That is freaking hilarious. This whole landing pad is now a target zone. Okay, I've got the spark sitting in between the upper portion of the H away from the birdie poop so that it doesn't land in that. Let's hope it lands in close to the S or the E or the W, but not near the N because that's going towards bird poop. It only records in 1080p, so when you see this video, when I upload it to YouTube, I do all my videos in pretty much 4K. So I'm gonna have to upscale the 1080p to 4K. So what that means is it won't look as sharp because it's taking a 1080p picture and it's stretching it to 4K. Might look a little blurry around the edges, but uh, just remember, this is a 1080p camera and it's a really good one. Uh, so in 4K it looks okay, but not as great as a real 4K. Powered on. I can hear it. I heard the word takeoff. It says motor start it. Ready to go GPS. I see the height. I'm going to take the height up to 20 meters. Here we go. And 20 meters. There we are. Okay, here we go. I'm going to send the spark out 100 meters ahead of me. Now it doesn't move as fast as a Mavic or the Phantom. I've got it at full speed just so it gets up there faster. Making its way. 
Is that 40 meters, 47, 48, 49, 50. So it's in normal mode. I don't have it in sport mode. As you can see, it doesn't fly very fast forward. I'm at 78 meters, 79, 80, 81, 90 meters, and I'm gonna let go now. It should stop nicely at 100. Oh, it's stopping at 99. And on the controller, I'm gonna hit the return to home button and let's see what she does. There we go, aircraft is returning to home. Going up to its return to home altitude, so it's rising. Turn home because it tells me it's reached its altitude, so it should be coming back. I hear it overhead. Take this camera. And let's go handheld and film this. Oh yeah. Looks like it's straight over top of me, which is not right. Oh, it's spinning around. Should be adjusting itself. Sorry if the image is shaky, I'm just holding it with my hand, taking a guess at where to point this thing. Coming down fast now. Coming down, looks like it's going over the pad. Stay away from the bird poop. There we go, look at it go. Coming down, there's the pad. There's the spark. Where are we landing? Where are you going, buddy? Oh, you missed the bird poop. But you're still within like freaking inches away. You took off right here and you landed right there. That is amazing. All right, I am, I am beyond impressed. Uh, all I can say is DJI, you make some really good products. So there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe below. Uh, there'll be more videos like this coming in the near future. I also have the Typhoon H, the, what the hell? There's my spark, he wants to get in the picture. All right, so, uh, anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe below. More videos on the way. Spark uh, is in sports mode and he just wants to cruise. See ya, Spark. Sparky, you're dangerous, but a lot of fun.